Here we go. Green, green, green. McIntyre to the inside. Pod to the high side. Pod still got that groove on the high side. Pod's drag race in the five of McIntyre. McIntyre still side by side with Pod in turn number three. Now through turn number four. McIntyre takes the lead, and here comes Jay Pepin up the inside of the one. Jay Pepin goes down to the inside. The one of Pod goes to the high side now. Pod goes back to third. Pepin now sitting second. Here comes Williger. Ricky Williger in the eight, following along with that number 43 of Jay Pepin. Pepin now takes over second. The one of Mike Pod is off the pace just a little bit, but there goes Williger in the third. Pod sitting fourth, and then you have two cars side by side, the seven and the 14. Of Quentin Murdoch and Scott Tonelli. Now Quentin Murdoch gets by Scott Tonelli. Scott Tonelli last week here had tough luck in the first feature as he hit the front end and had a whole bunch of front end damage that they got her fixed for the second one, made it back out. But here comes TJ Marshall in the number 15. New car to him. All redone, figuring it out. If you're looking for a hot rod in one of these, you might want to buy one of them up. There goes Jay Pepin to the lead in the 43 on the inside of Ian McIntyre. Here comes Ricky Williger. Here comes the one of Mike Pod. <coughs> McIntyre slides back four spots. Quentin Murdoch gets to fourth. And here comes TJ Marshall up the inside with the 15 looking on the five. But out front now, the 43 of Jay Pepin holding on to it. Here comes Ricky Williger. Williger is looking to the inside of the 43. The 43 and Williger. Pepin and Williger down the back stretch. Williger goes to the inside. Pepin slides back one. Here comes Mike Pod. He was just playing with them early. Now he's up into second. Williger's now out front, now stepping away. There goes Pepin. He loses two or three spots. He slides back to fourth. There goes Quentin Murdoch up into third. Williger's still out front with Pod holding on to second. Third is Quentin Murdoch, but he's got a mirror for the 43 of Jay Pepin. Pepin now trying to bounce off the back bumper just ever so slightly. Then you have McIntyre and TJ Marshall. Marshall looking up the inside. He gets by McIntyre. Ian McIntyre slides back one spot. TJ Marshall moves up to fifth. Marshall now in fifth in that brand new hot rod. Looks a little loose coming off four. He'll get that figured out. But out front still is the eight of Williger. Mike Pod had a little bit of an oops there coming out of four, but he's still holding on to second. Third is the seven of Quentin Murdoch. Then you have the four, the 43 of Jay Pepin in that four spot. Fifth is the 15 of TJ Marshall. Up front still the eight of Williger holding on to the lead with the one of Mike Pod holding on to second. We've kind of stretched out just a little bit. Everyone's getting their feet wet, kind of grooving and moving. We are 11 laps, 12 laps into the books. We're almost halfway. The eight of Williger, the one, of Pod, the seven. still out front. Pod sitting second. They've just lapped Wolseley and Quentin Murdoch sitting in third. Murdoch has slid back just a little bit from that group but for fourth and fifth you have a battle with Jay Pepin and TJ Marshall in the 43 and the 15. The 57 gets down and out of the way. Joey Wolseley, you'll know that name as there was his dad and his dad's two brothers all had cars here and ran in the Canadian Vintage Modifieds. 
in years past in the 57 in all different numbers, the two. But they're back at it. They've got a couple cars sitting in the barn back home that they're starting to put together and get the kids out here. And Grandpa's just loving it. But out front still is the eight of Williger. Second is Pod. Third is Murdoch. Fourth is Pepin. Fifth is Marshall. Sixth is the 14 of Scott Tonelli. Seventh, I would believe, is the five of Ian McIntyre. And then you have the 42 of Steve Murdoch. And then the 57 of Wolseley. 19 laps in, we're going to have five more to go this time by, five more laps to go. Five more laps down. Williger now setting a mean pace. The one of Pod is off the pace. Get him into the infield, they say. There's only a few laps left. Get him down and into the infield. And that puts Quentin Murdoch up into the second spot as Mike Pod has come up lame and sitting in the infield. Marshall now is up into fourth. Third goes to Jay Pepin. Pepin is in that third spot. It's a good run for him tonight as he's been really trying to figure this car out. With 22 laps down in the books. Here comes Williger down the back stretch into turn number three. As he's all by himself. He could Maybe go order a pizza with two laps left to go. Ricky Williger, gonna go down the back stretch. He'll get the white flag this time by. As Ricky Williger in the number eight will get the white flag. Quentin Murdoch is sitting second still. And the battle's heating up for third. As you have the 40, 43 of Joe Pepin and 15 of TJ Marshall. And here comes Tonelli to the dance. But here comes three and four, around three and four, down the front stretch one final time. The number eight of Ricky Wilger gets the first feature done. In second spot, be the number seven of Quentin Murdoch. And rounding out the top three, in the number 43 is Jay Pepin. We're going to here get a quick conversation with our feature winner of the number eight of Ricky Williger. No stranger, Ricky Wager in the number eight. Has a wait for him to unbuckle his five point harness. Takes the steering wheel off. He's gonna climb out here ever so soon. I think he's getting ready to climb out. Again, he wants to hear all the fans of the grandstand cheer as Ricky Williger climbs out of this hot rod. Here he comes. Gonna squeeze. I can't squeeze in one of these anymore. Give him a round of applause for Ricky Williger. Getting the first feature here tonight. Get over here, Ricky. Congratulations, bud. I haven't done this in a while, eh? It's nice seeing you here. Hey, uh, how's the car so far? Uh, she's amazing. She's a rocket out there. Excellent. Who do you want to thank for getting here? Uh, Triple Crown Enterprise, Oakville Trailers, my dad, Ron Easton, and uh, thanks for all the fans for coming out. i got to ask, what's the year of this car? Uh, I believe it's a 32. 32 Chev? Oh, uh, Ford. 32 Ford. There you go, 32 Ford. Give Ricky Wilger another big round of applause. We'll get a couple pictures here. We'll send them to the back. <laughs> 